Hello there. Here is a video on a scripted item that gives you a kit of uh, supplies that uh, this was inspired by Moss on Discord and it seemed like a really good idea and what you do you when you're holding it you right click and it gives you the shield and this sword here but it only gives you it for a few a limited amount of time and then it takes it away and also there's a cooldown when you can use it again you have to wait it's about 10 15 seconds something like that and you can also you can't toss these items nor can you open up a GUI or a chest GUI I'll show you that so um, so I try to open up that try and open up my inventory that way you can't steal these items you can't they are they're all taken away and you can't save them for later. We had a little bit of fire damage here, but uh, so how this works, a scripted item, this just shows you what it looks like and, and it has a custom name. Uh, this line isn't being used anymore, that was old, but it just basically runs this play player timer uh, if it's not running and everything else is in the player script right here. It would be uh, the timer event it creates these items and then if this player timer runs and this cooldown timer is not running it gives you those items um, then it runs these other timers this is how long the player gets to keep them the cooldown timer this 54 keeps the dialogue closed and this variable prevents you from tossing them with the toss event down here what it does it will cancel it if that variable is one so um, once this runs 52 then it starts taking stuff away it stops that the um, the GUI uh, canceling procedure and it, it allows you to toss things and then it takes things away. Now the sword has a special name that way it won't take away every diamond sword you have necessarily but it searches for this name and uh, uh, that's the only special one I have. The armor was easy because the armor is going to be on your body so it just can take that off. Then the shield it just uh, takes that um, away from you. If you would have, I have, whoops, I throw things a lot here. So if I have this shield here and I try it, um, so this is, so it's going to take away the one in my inventory and not this one. So that's going to take the first one it finds in my inventory. Um, and I think it would take it out of my offhand if it didn't uh, if it didn't find one. Whoops. No, I can't I can't throw this out now. So let me let me try doing that real quick here. But uh, so but that's how it works. Um, it was a little tricky to get everything to work together. Um, but uh, yeah, it'll just take it on my offhand if that's the only shield I have. So um, yeah, it, it works pretty good. I thought of using the key press event to, pr to keep the, uh, the inventory close, but that probably won't keep a chest inventory closed so you could you could like steal the swords if you wanted to and then they wouldn't be taken away from you and you could come back and get them so that's how you do that um, thanks for watching